Bought it out with half and I flipped it in a double Welcome back to my canal. If you are new to this channel, make sure that you hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on that bell notification button so that you never miss a video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to make dulces enchilados. Take a look. And what you don't know is that I'm going to also show you how to make a keto-friendly version. Stay so let's tuned. get started with the ingredients, you guys. You can choose any which one of these candies that you decide to use. You can use gummy savers. You can use airheads. You can use the sweetest fish. For the keto, um, you can use these keto gummies. And there's a lot of other keto snacks that you can get. Um, gold bear. Gold bears. <laughs> well, actually, it does say gold bears. Um, gummy bears. You can use gummy worms. You can use these chavito um, peach rings that are already kind of enchilados, but you can add a little bit more flavor to it. You can um, do it to these chaka chaka treats, these new fantasy gummies, which are cotton candy flavored, or, you know, your fruit roll-ups or any other candy that you decide. Don't forget that whatever you can't find in your local market, you can find on my Amazon storefront. All you have to do is check out amazon.com slash shop slash merce. Outside of the choice of candies that you guys to select to use, you are going to need powdered sugar. For my keto version, you are going to need this sugar replacement confectioner sugar. You're going to need chamoy, tahin, and you're going to need this Lucas mango flavor. Let's get started. All right, you guys, we're going to make things super, super, super easy. You're going to get two Tupperwares. Don't forget, again, anything that you cannot find at your local market, you can find on my Amazon storefront, amazon.com slash shop slash merce. The link will be in description below. So you get your two Tupperwares. In one Tupperware, you're going to get your tahine. Take this part out and pour liberally. Put this back on. You're going to grab one of these mango lucas. Just take the whole ooh, take the whole thing off. Pour that in because you're gonna sit here and save time. You're gonna put the lid on it, shake it up. That's ready to go. In this one, you are going to get a little bit goes a long way. You're going to get your powdered sugar. In my case, I'm gonna be using the keto kind. You're gonna get your regular kind. And I'm gonna show you just how little you need. You're gonna get your cuchara spoon. <laughs> You're gonna get your fucking favorite spoon that you use for your cereal, okay? This is a big boy. So I'm just gonna literally get one of them. One. Vas a aplastar todo. Make sure there's no clumps in there. Okay? You're going to get your chamoy, this this one, this brand that you can find on my storefront has no calories and no carbs. Woohoo. Okay, so you're gonna get one cucharada and literally when it's in here, look at that. It looks like mocos sliding around in there like a damn mess. You're gonna mix it up. telling you you don't need a lot of this you just literally need to superficially coat the top of it and if you aplastar your powdered sugar from the get you don't need to microwave it like a lot of other people do in their videos mira no clumps okay done i'm gonna grab my keto gummies and we're going to toss them in here don't make yourself a mess make this as easy as possible for yourself you're gonna add one pack and you know what? I'm going to go ahead and add another pack. Two packs of keto gummies. There you go. Lid. Shake it up. Okay. 
Open it up, they're all coated. Open up your powder, it's already mixed white. Add it all differently in and then have more mango on one. No, we're trying to make things all equally here. So grab your gummies, put them in there. And see, there's still so much liquido left behind that I'm literally just getting a fork so I can just literally get the gummies because there's still so much left. Put that aside, get your lid to the dry powder, put your lid on it. I am not kidding you, it is that easy and you're welcome. Look at this. They're not sticky. You can refrigerate them. They're completely coated in the same equal seasoning. Let's do another one. So now I'm gonna get another fork. I'm gonna put it in a little Tupperware and this guy's done. Let's do some, hmm. Let's do some, what is this guy? Watermelon slices next. So let me go ahead and get this. No se gasta nada, se puede usar todo otra vez in el mismo container, so you're not sitting here wasting and redoing everything again. I'm telling you, this is the best way. Thank me later. You can do a bunch of variety of different candies or all of the same kind. Make sure there's no guy left behind and you're still stuck with all the same dry powder. So you're good. He's done. Alrighty, you can put him away. Now let's get our wet box. Let's put our watermelon. Dump him in. Get your lid, shake it up. They're coated, get your wet fork, dump all these guys in the dry powder. I'm telling you, it's this easy. Don't bother getting anybody else's recipe because this is the best way right here. Shake it up. Look at that. They're not wet. They won't stick together. You won't have to fight to separate them. And I'm gonna do one more, but first I need to try one of these keto ones. Just to know, oh my God, you're welcome, that I can have this. There's no penalties. I'm just so happy right now. Mm. I can't wait for you guys to try this. Okay, back to the show. Guys, here is your mango. Guys, here is your sandia treats covered in tahin and lucas. Here are the keto gummies. They don't stick, it's perfect. Here's the other candies that I got. If you guys wanna see me do all of these candies, make sure to give this video a fat thumbs up and I will show you. But a little bit went such a long way, you guys, I'm serious. You're welcome. Tag me, I love you guys, thank you. I also wanted to jump on here real quick, you guys, and tell you how appreciative I am for all the love you guys have shown my previous video. Don't mind the noise. That's daddy, of course, in the back because it wouldn't be a video if he wasn't in there somewhere. But just for all the love you guys have shown me in my previous videos, I really, really appreciate all the comments. I'm trying to get back to all of you um, as quickly as I can. I've gotten a lot of questions of where I've gotten my Tupperware, where I've gotten the spatulas, where I've gotten 
certain spices or keto treats. Everything is under certain tabs on my Amazon storefront. Don't forget amazon.com slash shop slash merce. The link is in the description below. Um, and the keto stuff, there's actually a tab that's like keto hacks or keto something. And then everything for the chamoy and all that is under fiesta. So make sure to check it out. And please, please, please tag me in your creations because I cannot wait to see. Let's go.